Cathedral of Naples, resting place of one of the holiest Roman Catholic relics in the world, the blood of St. Gennaro. Every year on May 1st, believers flock to Naples to witness a miracle. Today is the day the dried 1,500-year-old blood of St. Gennaro will liquefy. The body is dead, but the blood lives on. The blood of the saint is kept behind the altar in a vault. It is only removed on holy days and May 1st. Cardinal Yorsi of Naples takes the blood to the altar. It is dried and clotted in the vial. As you can see in these exclusive close-ups, what is in the bottle is solid. The dried blood is placed in a special carrier for a procession. It will be carried through the streets and then returned to the cathedral where the miracle hopefully will occur. The blood was saved by a nun after St. Gennaro was beheaded by the Romans in 305 AD. The miraculous properties were discovered 30 years later by accident when the Bishop of Naples touched the vial and the blood liquefied. Scientists who have studied the liquid swear it is blood. There is no scientific explanation for the liquefied. The Cardinal removes the blood for the service. It won't leave his hands for the next three hours. The blood is still coagulated. Now it is nothing more than a dried substance in a bottle. If the miracle happens, it will become liquid. The prayers begin. The sacred blood of the saint is still dry. The prayers continue. If the miracle doesn't happen, it's seen as a bad omen. When the miracle failed in 1980, Naples was hit with an earthquake. There is tension in the air. The prayers become more fervent. Two hours into the service and still the miracle hasn't happened. Now for you skeptics, temperature has no effect on the liquefying. The miracle has occurred in temperatures ranging from 40 degrees to 90 degrees. More prayers. In good years, it happens quickly. At last, the miracle has happened. The blood has liquefied. You can see the movement of the liquid. Our cameras were permitted the closest look at the miracle ever permitted by television crews. Modern science is unable to duplicate this with any substance. Once blood has dried, it is impossible to return it to its original state. The miracle of the blood of St. Gennaro. And we saw it because you asked for it.